Yeah, it's a great day for football in this lovely stadium. Martin Tyler here and Alan Smith with me. Our football is from the EFL Championship in England, Bristol City against Sheffield Wednesday. I think if we get a, a nice, sharp, quick tempo to begin with, we're in for a real treat here because we've got a couple of entertaining sides that love to go forward. For Bristol City, this is their lineup. Thomas Callas starts despite looking shaky in recent games, and it looks good in attack with these two strikers. Palmer. Set up to play on the break now. We could be in. And the defender tidies that up. Let's look at Sheffield Wednesday and the list of their players here. I think that back four is really important for them. They've got to be strong and solid, but they've got a bit of protection, haven't they? They have. They should have more than enough. I mean, they're all good defenders in their own rights, but uh, in front of them, they've got players who are going to be working really hard. Whether they could be a fit on the front foot, we'll wait and see. Well, they keep moving the ball here. In goes the cross. Well, they've gone for it right from the off, and they've got their reward with an early opening goal here. Well, I know they've been working on this all week long, Martin, and boy, has it paid dividends. Lovely finish. And that has opened the scoring. 1-0 here. Number 14, Benedict Afobi. Clark. They read the opponent's mind and got the ball. Bit of pressure on the player, that's why it's gone out. Now he's got the ball, what's he going to do with it? Row anticipated the direction of the pass and was able to intervene. Not a great tackle, I must say. Well, that's a yellow card. Yeah, I don't think there's any choice there from the ref. Well, that's risky going in like that. Has he lost control here? Gone to ground. It is a foul, no doubt about it. Well, he's read that, hasn't he? And made the interception, made it look easy, actually. An opportunity here. There's some space to work the ball into. Well, that's drifted straight out of play, that attempted cross. It's a goal kick. Anderson. Well, here he goes. It's good to see a player do this. It should be! A really vibrant, venomous volley. Well, the cross was great for him, and it made up his mind, and what a goal. It was a wonderful watch, that goal. Well, it's come in from a long way out, and from that angle, it's not always easy to finish. Defenders caught out by it in the end. It is uh, level. Both sides have scored here now.
Palmer. Game still level, but the pressure might be counting. Shot on! Well, the keeper got to that and probably should have done. Yeah, you would expect him to save it, and he did. Oh, they played it short. They spread it out wide here. Chance to get some width into this attack. Has to be! You can understand why he's kept going for goal, having scored in the game. Uh, but this one has passed him by. Yeah, I don't think you can knock him for having a go from there. He's in a good position. And the tackler has been very successful there. He's got possession. The hosts have controlled possession here so far. But I don't think the manager will be happy down there watching this performance. He would have been expecting more. The fans would, and I was. You have to feel that they will step it up sooner or later. Difficult for the defender against the pump too close to the keeper in the end. Cleverly done. Good work, really, to read the intention of the pass. Referee has blown, and he's given the free kick. Here's Brown. Good reading of the... by anticipating the pass. Powerful drive, close enough to suggest... Have another go, son. Yeah, strong shot. I think the keeper saw it coming all the way, though. Andreas Weiman. Rowe. The referee's had a good look and decided what he's seen from this uh, period of play to add on three minutes. He's given it away. Well, everything to play for in the second half. We've reached half-time. And here we go. The referee's blown his whistle, and we're off for the second half. Made sure the pass wasn't completed. Now, can he take them on? In with a chance. Confident goalkeeping here. Yeah, good hand to turn it aside. Corner given. And they'll be hoping to get this set piece right for a goal that will put them into the lead. Couldn't keep it. He had to hold off that challenge to come away with the ball. I think that's a good performance, isn't it, Alan, from him in the first half? Yeah, he stepped up to the mark in that first half, just when his team needed him, just when they were searching for an equaliser. Interesting to see how the second half pans out now. Put the ball into the middle, dangerous. Got time to set the sights here. Men in the middle frustrated because that cross has gone straight behind.
Hines. Sheffield Wednesday's next game, Alan. Yeah, they're playing West Bromwich Albion in the next match in the Championship. And uh, I don't know really what the score's going to be here. I don't think there's going to be much between them. Well, they're getting the ball forward. They need to do that. He's in. And there it is! It's all about the weight of the pass here. He hardly had to break stride and he finished it emphatically. Off we go again, 2-1. Steered through. Put in from the wide area. And they've got it away from the danger. Palmer. Nodge. Andreas Weimer. It's good work here in terms of possession. Can they find the final pass? Cut out the pass. The defender really putting his body on the line to stop the cross. Set up to play on the break now. Well, this could be the leveller. Oh, that's great defending. That's out of danger there with that clearance. Out into the wide areas now. It's going to be a substitution here for the home side. Well, they've got him behind here. He's made the interception. And shoots! It could be a chance. Powerful drive. Close enough to suggest, have another go, son. Yeah, strong shot. I think the keeper saw it coming all the way, though. Well, what will this mean for the team? They're going to bring two new players on. And that's neatly done. Good challenge by the defender. Very good control, though. They've lost the ball. The hosts imposing their authority last 15 in terms of possession. And if there's going to be a goal... I think we can guess which end it's going to come because there's all sorts of pressure coming now. They're doing all the pushing, aren't they? They're producing all the quality football, to be honest with you. And if they can get that extra bit of daylight, they'd fancy themselves, I reckon, to see it through. Beric, trying a bit too hard, trying to force the pass, and it went uh, straight to an opponent. Excellent vision, and he scored! Oh, the crowd appreciating that, and so are his teammates. What a good finish, and what a good ball through to him. Just a reminder, 3-1 it is now, the scorer. Really trying to use the full width of the pitch here to make... In front of goal, struck the post here. That was a puff-out-your-cheeks moment and, phew, got away with it. Ten minutes left of regular time. And here they are, still probing away. 
there's the chance. Oh, just shaved the bar. Yeah, unlucky. Hits it well enough. That's got him out of a tight area with that back heel. Well, let's hear about the goal in the Brentford game from our man on the spot, Alan McAnally. It's a goal for Brentford. Five minutes remain. 1-0. Thanks, Alan. Uh, we'll follow that with interest. And this is going to be a throw. And the manager, Alan, is making this change here. Substitution will take place. Well, he's done his bit. He's got the goal that put his team in the lead. Can they hold that lead? Three minutes. That's all that's left now. Well, look at the room in which to attack. That's a brilliant challenge. Two more minutes to play of added time. Two minutes of added time. Baker gets the ball out wide with time to assess the situation. From the byline, cuts it back. Quick reaction time here from the goalkeeper. Decided that this time they're going to play the short corner. It's a shot. And that shot's blocked very quickly. Looking a problem. And it's come to an end here with the final whistle. Anderson. 